three teenagers at a bus stop just south of Jerusalem on the night of June 12th. Naftali Frankel and Gilad Shah are 16 years old and Eyal Yifrach 19 years old. Their last communication was at 10.30 p.m. They have disappeared, taken by Hamas terrorists. The search continues for three teenagers who went missing in the West Bank late Thursday night. Officials believe three teens, all Jewish, and between well, the ages their of names 16 are Gilad and Shar, Elad Yifrak, and Naftali Frankel, who might be an American My citizen. My son texted me, said Authorities he's on his way home, and then he's alive. gone. Report. Every mother's nightmare is waiting and waiting endlessly for her child to come home. An entire home. nation came together, holding its breath. People around the world prayed and hoped. We just want them back in our home, in their beds. We just want to hug them again. But that did not happen. You are watching CNN. Got some breaking news for you uh, on this on Monday afternoon. An update for you. Israel says the bodies, bodies of, of the boys were Israeli found near Hebron. Have been found. The news of their brutal murder has been painful and impossible to absorb. So who could do it? Who could murder a 19-year-old, two 16-year-old boys? Well, Israeli Prime Minister Israel is mourning as funerals were held for the three teens. The grief and outrage over these murders tonight in Israel is extraordinary. Eyal, Naftali, and Gilad, we all mourn for you. My 16-year-old son, Naftali, sends us a text and says he's on his way home. Next thing we know, we're in the middle of the most surreal situation. Those 18 days, they were filled with the darkest hours, but also amazing hours. We discovered our family, our friends, our community, our country, our people. Cape Town, in Kathmandu, in Australia. There were delegations from all over North America, Europe. People all over were saying, these are not just your boys, these are our children. It's no illusion. What we saw about ourselves, we're part of something huge. We're part of a people, of a true family. That's for real. Rosh Hashanah is coming up. Let's all choose an act, large or small, to keep the spirit of those days alive. It was said, we went out searching for the boys and we discovered ourselves. 